we are at Leodosia. This is the cave we come to look for as part of our leaky foundation research. It's first entered for paleontology or archaeology by Jaboy. And we're just heading into the cave now. The big entrance. Um, the cave is currently locked off to look after the swallows that are in here, but we'll see that in a second. So we have a large, very large column here that's formed. So that's natural, that's a Spilurethan type of formation. We're just heading into the guys. There's a hole here, we might just be able to squeeze through it. Here we can see, we can see the lock over here. So we're going to try and negotiate some access to get in there. Um, yeah, sometime maybe for the next tomorrow couple of days. Morning, for tomorrow uh, morning. The local people say oh, we can get the access. Fantastic. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Here we are in Lida Ye Cave. This is the same cave that Jawa visited around about 120 years ago. And what we can see uh, through here is a series of bone brushes. So this is where the fossils are coming from. We can see several teeth in the deposit already just eroding out. So we haven't collected too many just yet, but there's plenty of things all the way down through here. So it's quite an exciting discovery for us. We've got a couple of teeth that have just popped out already. You can see a tooth of a rhino, so it's a lower molar from some type of uh, Sumatran rhino. Um, a couple of other little bits and pieces down here as well um, to be identified. This is a cool specimen though. This is a molar tooth from Pongo, or better known as Urangatang. So the cave has a lot of promise at the moment. And uh, we're going to start doing a little bit of mapping of the cave uh, to put, be able to put the fossils in context. And uh, yeah, that's where we're at at the moment.